Hello friends, welcome to my channel Automator. Today I have upgraded one of my Automator tool Node.js API Generator to work on Mac OS so that not only Windows user but the Mac user also can generate Node.js API. Let's start the demo but before that if you have not subscribed please do subscribe, like and share. So let's see this is my tool this is my node.js api generator tool which will generate node.js api using mysql database so let's see where is my database so i have local host in and php my admin installed in my system so this is my eSOP database which is a test database we i have made for demo purpose so in this table, in this database, we have account, account types, addresses, address types, cities are there, city states are there, means many fields are there, many foreign keys are there, many columns, different types of columns are supported like date, time, bit or integer or var char descriptions also are also there. So let's see if my Node.js API generator can generate a API for my this database. So this is my Node.js API generator tool. I just have to double click and it will start. So it's asking me what folder name, enter folder name. So I want to generate my eSOP API. So I'll name it as eSOP API. I'll increase the font little. So I'm giving the folder name as eSOP API. Host name is localhost. Database name is my eSOP. You can see here. So I'll give it my eSOP. Database username is root for me. My system have root user. And the password for my system is blank. So I'll just click enter. And you see the files are automatically generated at this location. So if I go to my if folder the, where the application was there so i have these files generated which have roots based on all the tables you have according to your database then you have models which will have the database logic then you have a controller which will control the calling of your database logic and all so this is the file generated without touching any line of code from my side so let's see if it works or not so i will start my terminal here open a new terminal at this location increase the font little so i am at this eSOP api which is generated from the node generated node api generator tool so let's install the M npm install on this folder so that all the dependency will be installed through package.json Okay, so it's running. Okay, so it's done. So if you notice the node modules are all downloaded from npm. So let's start node server dot js. Server dot js is nothing but my starting point of the node js API. So API server has started 8400 so i have to go to localhost 8400 to test my api so let's see i have a city table so it is having bangalore so go to localhost 8400 and then i have a city table so see so the get city api is working for us so if i increase little bit font so you can see I have a Bangalore in this column and that's why it is coming here Bangalore. If I insert another row here, let's uh, insert city as um, Simbla. And the created by is 1001 and date is something I'm just entering so this all you can you need you can do it from the postman actually through the same API what we have generated 
so just for sample I am inserting so I have now two CT let's refresh the get CT API so you can see the similar is working so I have not written any line of code yet I have just used my node.js API generator it generated this folder eSOP API which folder name I have given and then went to this folder I opened my terminal at this location and then run the npm install to install all the dependency and then I started my server using node server.js and nothing else I have done. So this is the tool to generate the node.js API. Hope you like the tool. I will also add a postman JSON in the download package so that you know how to create request, how to post, uh, delete, update and all the request whatever is required to test this API you can do. So you will have sample a, a database of my ESOP like I am putting it here. Then I will keep this code also here in this generated code also I will keep it here in the package so that you can see what all codes are generated and how it is generated. And then I will also add a postman JSON of all four requests create, update, delete and get. So hope you like the tool. If you like the tool, please do subscribe to my channel Automator. I will publish this video soon after publishing it to the package from where you can download it. The link source link to that. Thanks a lot for watching the video.